Come on now, y'all, man. I know I ain't the only person that want to see Andre Ward against Adonis Stevenson. You know what I mean? Man, Adonis Stevenson is getting old, man. The man 39 years old, man. You feel me? We got this man. We out here watching this man fight. Man, hold on, man. Let me read this article, man. I read in Boxing News 24. It was saying, will we get a big fight for Adonis Stevenson? Now, I read this article in Boxing News 24 by Gav Doody. And it was uh, saying, uh, will we get a big fight for Donna Stevenson? You know what I mean? <laughs> will we? All right, so here goes what the article was saying. We are going around in circles and watching the career of brilliant but stagnant Adonis Stevenson. The big punching Canadian destroyed Fonfara in two rounds a few Saturdays ago in a senseless rematch that nobody ne needed to see. Stevenson is 39 years old. And we are currently seeing him once a year against average opposition. And that's some real ass shit. I mean, I don't really want to see the man fight somebody. He said, I often feel sorry for strong competition without decent potential opponents. You can only beat what's there. But light heavyweight is probably the best division in boxing right now. The 175-pound category, both Sergey Kovalev, Andre Ward, John Pascal, Joe Smith Jr., Sullivan Barrera, Badu Jack, Nathan Cleverly, and more. Despite the depth of the competition, Stevenson hasn't beaten anyone in the current top 10 with his last win of real significance coming in 2013 against Tony Bell. To me, it's like the Rigadow effect on some fighters, man. You know, really just can't get no love, man, because, I mean, all right, the last time. He fought somebody, they said, it was Tony Bell, you really, right? And then Fon Fair fight, he just fought. When nobody really cared about. Nobody really was hyped about it, you know. And then he, he fought Fon Fair like three years ago. It was a good fight. You know, he got knocked down, came back, beat him up. You know what I mean? Had a one United in his decision. And then, you know, everybody wanted to rematch. But shit, you know, he, shit, but shit, Fon Fair beat motherfucking Julius Ch uh, Cesar Chavez, you know, he beat some people, you know what I mean, so, he wasn't no scrub, but still, though, and then, you know, what makes it so funny is Virgil Hunter trained Fon Fair, man, you know what I mean, it's funny to see Virgil Hunter in the corner, waving, like, no, stop the fight, you know what I mean, throwing in the towel and shit, last time, that, that last fight, but, uh, yeah, man, Stevenson, man, deserve it, man, he's 39 years old, Everybody want to give uh, Andre Ward TBE. You know, I heard somebody compare him to TBE, man. I think it was uh, 78 now. They were comparing him to TBE. But uh, that man ain't TBE. That man, they said his biggest fight was Kovalev, dog. They said his biggest fight was Kovalev. Look at Kovalev's resume. Bernard Hopkins was his biggest fight, man. Come on, Floyd fought Oscar De La Hoya. He didn't went up and fought Canelo. He didn't fought so many names. You can't compare Andre Ward because Andre Ward, then Andre Ward threw everybody off with that moving up to cruise away and I fight a heavyweight Anthony Joshua shit. Don't nobody want to see you fight no motherfucking Andrew and Anthony Joshua. You really gonna be hitting them in the nuts. This boy a fool, man. Y'all make me not like Andre Ward. Real talk, man. Like I don't see nothing real about him. You feel me? He started. He threw the fans off instead of saying Adonis Stevenson. He started talking about fighting the cruiserweight and fighting the heavyweight. You know, you know the motherfucker say I don't know nothing about boxing and all that shit. And I respect that. It's OGs that know shit about boxing. But me, I got a lot of common sense and I smell shit. You feel me? I can smell a motherfucker breath. When they talk, they don't brush their teeth, I can smell their shit, goddammit. Motherfucker, I smell shit, man. I got a good nose, man. And uh, Andre Ward, when you talking, man, smell like shit, man. Talking about you you want to fight Aunt. Nigga, fight Deontay Wilder again, nigga. That's what I tell them all for. Everybody was trying to call out Anthony Joshua, steroid-looking ass. Fight. I ain't going to say that. I'm going to erase that. Sorry, Andy. You do look like you, like you pop a pill or something every once in a while. But, you know, I ain't I ain't going to say that, though. But that, that disrespect, I don't fuck with no conspiracy. I got to know. You know, if I say you did it, you did it, you know. But, um, yeah, man. Y'all got the game all twisted, man. Boy, Andre Ward, he got to fight this man, Stevenson.
before he retired. Man, Stevenson is 39 years old. <laughs> 39 years old. We talking about Floyd fighting old. Come on, man. Get Stevenson this fight. Give it to him. He deserves it. Thanks, champion. And he, before I let you go real quick, I'm going to talk to Kovalev in a second. I know you just had the biggest win of your career. Do you have any thoughts about the near future? Maybe cruiserweight. I don't know. You want another belt? Maybe cruiserweight. I don't know. Cruiserweight, heavyweight, that's always been a dream of mine. Got to be against the right guy, but hey, man, I dream big, and, and anything is possible when you got God in your life. Heavyweight, but not Anthony Joshua heavyweight, right? There's a limit to everything. Anything is possible, man. Thank you, champ. Congratulations. Thank you, baby. Thank you.